So this was a study, uh, a phase one, phase two study in patients with advanced renal cell carcinoma with clear cell renal cell carcinoma or predominant clear cell variant. And the study was looking at the combination of two active agents in renal cell carcinoma, pazopinib, which is a standard first line treatment, and pembrolizumab, an immunotherapy. And immunotherapy has shown activity post uh, VEGF tyrosine kinase inhibitors. So although pazopinib has a place uh, in the first line treatment, we know that, that patients with renal cell carcinoma still a lethal illness with a median overall survival of around about three years. So the, the theory behind this to combine two active agents to see if we can improve efficacy and ultimately uh, outcomes is a very sensible one. So this was a study that looked initially at combination of pembrolizumab and pazopinib, two different uh, uh, doses, uh, dosing schedules, um, one of 800 milligrams of pazopinib cohort A, one of pazopinib at 600 milligrams, both given with three weekly pembrolizumab, the standard dosing regimen. Um, although sort of preliminary efficacy was seen in the study, Unfortunately, when the two drugs were combined, we saw an excess of dose-limiting toxicities, particularly hepatotoxicity, and that led to this particular uh, strategy of combination um, being discontinued and not taken forward. Having said that, we felt that it was reasonable to, to try uh, an alternative approach, which was looking at a lead-in phase of pazopinib, um, a run-in phase of nine weeks to try and exclude any, any uh, adverse events, particularly hepatotoxicity. Um, unfortunately, the 21 patients who went into that, only seven were able to go onto the combination. Uh, sorry, only five were able to go into the combination. And of those, of the, of the first, of those five, three also had dose-limiting toxicities, not ones with, regarding hepatotoxicity. So, unfortunately, with regards to this, this use of these drugs, either in combination or sequence, um, doesn't appear to be tolerable despite some initial efficacy, and therefore this combination isn't going to be taken forward.